Okay, for, for Solomon Islands, uh, uh, we actually use the, and I actually use the uh, pillar results for the yeah, year six uh, teachers uh, professional development training program based on the, the, the phase out uh, assessment guideline. Yeah, based on the, on the result, uh, one of the areas that really stands out in, in, in our report is that the students are having difficulties uh, with the high order uh, questions. And therefore, the focus as part of the uh, year six uh, phase out training program is we we'll are actually looking at the item constructions. And of course, uh, the performance task uh, development uh, by using the learning frameworks such as the Solos taxonomy and also the blooms uh, and this one will really enhance the uh, the teacher's capability to, to, to construct items according and targeting the different abilities of students in the classroom so the interventions which uh, I actually did with this uh, during this program the year uh, six phase out is actually looking at the construction of questions and of course, development of the performance tasks for, uh, as part of the interventions, targeting those learning outcomes, which were very problematic. I think this is a very important initiative, uh, especially this uh, digital platform. It actually enhances the accessibility. And one, one very important area is it's very interactive. Like, in terms of accessibility, even like even the teachers and the students or the parents and other stakeholders, you can just go to the website and access it. Uh, unlike before, we used to disseminate only the hard copies, which sometimes can be very inaccessible by the stakeholders or even the teachers and the students also at the school level.